Hello everybody, Sean here, and we're taking a look at the Curse Rotted Greatwood, the probably third boss you will face in Dark Souls 3, and this fight looks pretty intimidating, but don't worry, it's actually quite simple. When it starts out, you're just going to want to finish off any of the remaining minions that are kind of walking around. You probably killed a few before the fight began, you could finish them off when the fight starts, because the tree is quite slow. Now to actually hurt the tree itself, you'll notice we're going to aim for these pod-like protrusions on its body. This is the only spot it will take damage. Not necessarily these ones in the front, but only the pods. The front ones are the most obvious, but there's some on his hands, on his legs, on his back, they're all over the place. After they've taken so much damage, they'll explode and then deal even more damage to the boss. And at a certain point, the boss will get a little upset with you, smash the ground, and voila, the ground disappears. Don't worry, you won't take any fall damage. This is the second phase of the fight, and at this point, the tree will gain a couple new attacks, mostly because it now has a creepy-looking arm sticking out of the center of its body. The method of defense, the method of attack here doesn't really change. Just stay out of the way of the tree. Most of his attacks are forward-facing. He does have a couple that kind of circle around him, but they don't really deal a whole lot of damage. His strongest attacks are all forward facing, so if you stay to the side and to the back, you likely won't take a lot of damage. You'll see as well, most of his attacks are very slow, so if you see him lifting himself up, back up. If you see him winding up a punch, get out of the way. If you see him starting to spin in circles, again, back up. All you want to do for the second phase of the fight is when you see an opening, when the tree's recovering, when it's not attacking, Run in, smash the pods. Anytime they explode, you'll see the tree get stunned again. So if you're lucky, you'll see another pod, as I did here. Boom, stunned again. You just go from pod to pod to pod, hitting him over and over. If you can't find one, you can attack the arm, although that's not the ideal situation because he just usually lifts the arm out of the way, making it hard to hit. He doesn't seem to be terribly weak to anything, so just use your normal melee weapon. But, of course, if you have fire or magic, it probably will add bonus damage, but he didn't seem particularly weak to it. But there you go. The Rotted Greatwood is down. I hope this helps you out. I thank you for watching, and we'll see everyone next time.